Thank you, my nurse. Okay. I'm literally gonna give Trips one last chance to learn Gus. Um, one more level and we'll see what happens. Uh, we'll walk down here instead. We'll just destroy these pities and ratatats. I think these ones can reach up to level 4. And that's it. I'm not sure if they go up to 5 or 6. Because honestly, I only know basic knowledge. I don't know specifics. Like if you would ask me, do you know what the missing no is? I'd say yes. But the thing is, I don't know specifically if you can do it in this game, which I think not. Because there's a bug that fixed it. And I don't remember hearing anything about that. Or because this is an updated graphical version of the Pokemon game that they had missing no, then holy crap. HD missing no. Holy <laughs> okay, so mistake open me up and let me learn Gus. Just Pidgey, I mean chirps, chirps, sorry, chirps. Just the uh, Gus for me. You can flap your wing. There he goes. Moment of Trout. Yeah, yes! Thank you. Thank you. Okay, well since I'm here, he knows Gus. Let's let that synergy just fight for a little bit till he gets hurt. No we'll go uh, we'll finally move along. Oh my god, how long does it take two episodes? I am so sorry. But um, I literally wanna record everything on my first Nuzlocke vlog journey, which means that's why I'm not gonna cut any parts out and mostly the reason I'm talking to you. Get stuff off my chest, talk to the stream, and um, you know, pass the time. This is part of Pokemon. Now, even though Pokemon is a huge commercial success, um, there is a huge, huge flaw that most people don't really care to, to learn about, or they just don't even want to notice it, which is you know, games like Mario, Sonic, even like Final Fantasies. There is a game over screen. Mario, you run out of life, it's over. Sonic, you get hit twice, you're dead. You know, Final Fantasy, you lose in your party, you go back to your last save. Pokemon, not really much of a, um, not really much of a punishment, punishment system besides losing the money. What I'm saying is, the only thing you do is you might have to lose half your money. You don't lose a Pokemon, you don't lose no experience, and you certainly don't go back to your last save, because that would be ridiculous. Just go to the last Pokemon place you saved, which is freaking awesome. <laughs> Someone just jumped in the chat. He said, um, I dare you to grind all your Pokemon to level 20 in this grass. Wow, that sounds very, very enticing. I don't think that would make some good episodes. <laughs> so, Synergy is 10, Chirps is 9. We are going to head to the Verdant Forest right now. I have guts I can probably blow right through it. So, quick little heal, we'll head in there, and remember, we are in the Nuzlocke Challenge, so the first Pokemon I see in the Verini Forest, I must catch it. If I kill it, it's gone forever. So let's go ahead and do this. It's gonna be, it's gonna be great. Like I said before, uh, the Pokemon I want is a Pikachu or a Caterpie, because Butter Butterfree, Flying Pokemon slash Psychic is gonna help a lot. Excuse me, old man, and your portable TV. Thank you. Plus five. Yeah, that's good. So when I do hit with a tackle, it does do the extra damage. Dun, 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 dun. I can, can you imagine? Have you, have you guys ever even seen a Pidgey tackle in the show? How, what does he do? Does he just grab with his wings or something? Isn't his wings supposed to be very light? Okay, so. Um, there should be an antidote or a random Pokeball in the grass this way. I think it's up left. Alright, yeah, okay. It's gonna be up there and for sure. I'm gonna run to a Pokemon. Wish. Hopefully it's a good one. Let's get a move on. Here it goes, here it goes, here it goes. No, 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 Pokeball. Haven't ran into one yet. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, now in red version, I think in blue version as well, there is a certain spot in the Raiden Forest where it's much more easier to catch a Pikachu, which is around the top right area. That's where I'm gonna head first. Um, yeah, let's battle. I don't care. I have Gust. I have Gust. <laughs> let's do it. How much you got? Oh, two, one, two, four? Oh, shit. 
the Weedle. Oh, you can get poisoned in Pokemon. You're so annoying. One hit kill, one hit kill, come on. Come on. Yes, I thought I'm talking. Yes. How you do, Chirps? I might even main Chirps. A great Pokemon, man. Well, you we can't really learn anything else besides um, flying Pokemon. I think that's why, like, Ruby is one of the best Pokemon games out there. Um, up to date, you know, to date, because we just have so many different types of Pokemon. Level 10, good. So here it is, let's go to the area where I believe Pikachu will just pop up the most, which is like I said, the top right area of this map. Yeah, I'll fight this guy too. Let's go ahead and do it. Yo, you can't jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer. You mean like jam out? I mean like jam out. I don't, I don't know what you're saying, dude. Freaking country kid, man. Get a bug Pokemon. What's that, huh? This guy's a step up from the other guy. HP does mine. I think it's like 25 or something. So yeah, like I said before, before I fight Brock, I still need to learn Vine Whip. Wait, wait, I think I did learn it. Never mind. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I learned it right away. What am I, level 11? So that should get me through Brock's place. Um, if I get... I could get wiped out right here. I have to just watch... Uh, not right here, but I made Brock's gym. Um... If my Bulbasaur gets wiped out, there's no chance my chirps that kill them. Um, cause this isn't really effective, but it still hits a lot. Like, it only hits a lot of crit, even if it's not super effective. Damn, 106, huh? Bad. Great, zero defense. That sucks. Uh, huh? Alright, another Pokemon. Well, I'll be mugged them, $84. Ooh, what do we got here? Um, antidote. Aha, uh -huh, I knew it. Alright, here it is. This is the place where I usually catch the Pikachu. Wish me luck. I would love to have this electric rat on my team. It'd be good for Flash. Please, Pikachu, 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 Pikachu. Ah, uh, fucking... Ah, oh, that is the worst, that is the worst. This is the first Pokemon that I've encountered in this area, so I have to catch him or no Pokemon at all. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Yeah, it's the worst. It's the worst. Well, him or Metapod. If I, if I had Metapod, at least I can switch it out. Stop wasting my ball. Okay, he hardened twice. I think I can maybe tackle him one more time and he won't die. But yeah, like I said before, if I at least had a Metapod, I could switch him out, give him some experience so he can catch people with 3 bucks a You get to beat him. No one wants to beat him. He's a flying. Is he poison? I don't remember. He, he might know, like. I don't know if it's worth using him at all. Um, okay, the only thing poison will work really, really well against, I think, is. Um, Psychic, right? Psychic Pokemon. That would have been funny if like a P2 pops up here, the game would be just the game would just be mocking the crap. <laughs> Here's your Pikachu! Why did I get my Okay. Get out of here. I'll fight you. What do you got? Did you know that Pokemon evolve? No. Thanks for teaching me. Pretty sure Rock Brock's Onyx knows Rock. So that means um, the rock throws my bowl, so it's gonna be super effective. I think. I'm not sure if rock is super effective to grass. Do you know who it is? I don't really know. Alright, I just don't remember. Because I, I literally have played only the first version a hundred times more than this one, so there are a couple of uh, things I'm not really sure of. So, rock. Throw is weakness against my Bulbasaur, my Pidgey, and if I decide to use Beedro, which sucks. Hmm. Okay, so my only choice is to get Bulbasaur extremely strong so he can tank Pidgey. Because I'm going to assume that Onyx is slower than my Bulbasaur. I don't have enough speed. Na -na -na -na. Good job, Chirps. 
But yeah, the, the main reason why I got Bulbasaur was Cobra and the Cerulean Gym. Just easy way to get past them. I mean, Squirtle would be good too, but he, he'll only be good for the first gym. Second gym, he's on a level playing field, they both know water moves. And, and you know, Bulbasaur is my favorite starter out of the first generation of three anyway. So, there you go. Alright, Chirps, do this thing. Out of this area. Is there, a, is there something there? There it is. What do we got? Uh, Paralyze Heal. Potion. Even better. I'm just guessing now. What does this say? Trader tips. Did you know you can walk left? We had catch Pokemon that belongs to <laughs> Thanks, thanks, thanks. Dun, 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 dun. Aha! What do we got? Hey, where are you at? Want you to hurry. Why the rush? Dude, dude, calm down. Speak to me. Don't speak at me. to me. Okay? He has one Pokemon, it's gonna be level 9. We don't know. Oh my god, how did I not pick so many Pokemon? Or I just played this beginning part way too much and I just have mostly all the chat memorized. Don't poison me, don't poison me, bro. I swear, I just wanna get through this whole place without getting poisoned at once. Yes! I got critical, but no poison. Good, good, good. Great. I think it's the first time I've ever been through um, Brain Force without being poisoned or. Last time I could remember. Level 13. Man. Quick attack. Awesome. Um, I believe it hits like... Uh, 75? And tackle hits about 50? Let me look at that. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright. This is how I want it to look like. 40 and 35. Okay. Pokemon Evolution Council Technique? Oh, thanks. Alright, here's the deal. I am on Route 2. Most people would think this is a new area for catchy Pokemon in a Nuzlocke challenge, but it's part of Route 2, which was the area right before I went in, so I'm not going to catch any Pokemon here. But what I am going to do is I have to train my Synergy just a little bit. Either till level 13 or 14, so we'll fight around here. I'm not sure if we can find it around here, but it's too late for that. There's probably some um, places I'm forgetting to talk about, like uh, Safari Zone or something, and what the rule might be when I get to that area, but that's a long way off, and there's no point talking to it if I never even get there. So, we're going to talk to all the places as they come up, and we'll decide what kind of rules I will apply in the Nuzlocke Challenge to it. So, so far, um, if you haven't seen the episode before, you don't know exactly all the rules I have, so make sure to go check those out. Okay, Cyber Kira can see my stream again. Thank you. That was on Let's do this. Are you watching on your tablet? On oh, your iPhone, right? Oh, no. And uh, I'm just saying, talking all professional like, because this is going to be on the YouTube later. 20 minutes long each. And it was horrible because I spent the first 40 minutes leveling up my Pokemon in the Viridian City. It was bad. It was bad. Okay, um, yeah, I'm gonna get, um, Synergy to level 14 or 13. You know what, I think in Red Version, um, he learns Vine Whip at level 14. And this new revised one was level, what level am I right now? Um, 10. Yeah, he learns at 10, so that's... Awesome. 
There's no Pokemon that you can catch in the Peter Gym, huh? Unless they added some sort of patch of grass I'm not aware of, which I don't think they did. I'm probably thinking of like another game, another version where they did that. This Pokemon hardly doing any damage to me, but at the same time, I'm hardly getting any experience from it, so I'm kind of out now, I guess. There should be like a million Metapods here so I can just destroy them. Oh man, Pokemon that have evolved first give so much more experience. What the heck? Do you guys see that on my mind map? It was yellow already, so that means I have really low PP with that move. Which kind of sucks, because that's, oh, that's my uh, Synergy's nuke. Let me see how much. Pidgey level 4! It's, um, it's only 10? 10 PP. Sucks. Uh, here's the thing, I don't know if um, Synergy will learn, you know, Absorb or Mega Drain on its own. I know for sure he learns um, Poison Powder, Sleep Powder, and Paralyzed Powder. He learns it around the same level. Two levels apart. I really love level 2 at that. You gonna do that to me right now? Okay, let's, let's take it. Let's take it a while. Right, let's just quickly go in town and see if there's... Oh god, okay. Okay, fight another fight down here. This is awkward. I still haven't found a Spearow or any Nidorans. Maybe they changed the spawn location or... It's probably just different because I'm in Leaf Green. Utah City. So, okay, for some reason I thought there was a grass, some grass here, but I guess not. What's up? Um, a stay, a grass, stay, gray city. Do you know what I'm doing? You're jacking off. Leave me alone. Oh, okay. Let's heal up and junk. And no, we are not going to fight. Nidoran is in the grass just before the forest. Well, I've been, I was training them for a long time, like maybe 25 minutes, and I've done at least 15 battles, and I didn't find it. I didn't find it. Unless you're talking about the grass less, um, left of Viridian, I went in there. I didn't really train in there, but I went in there to pick up a Pokemon, and I picked up uh, I picked up Chirps there, so that was lucky. Prince, Prince Jr. <gasps> I forgot the name Kakuna. <gasps> Well, I'm never gonna use them, so it doesn't matter, but I'm supposed to name every single Pokemon. I fudged up. You have to remind me, just name whatever. And, um, if I do, like, if you guys are here, whenever I catch a new Pokemon in a new area, feel free to just throw some names out, and I'll name it. Just make sure it's not too crazy. Um, he's a bug Pokemon. Does grass work on it? Okay, it's a lot. This is the ass starter. Level 13 is gonna be a ways off, I know it. And I'm not really getting much experience in here, so let's go back inside here. Soda, you guys wanna know what soda? It's uh, well, I'm trying to stay off the caffeine as much as possible, I'm trying to stay kind of pure with water, but I decided to drink this anyway. It's a. Uh, I don't know if we can read that. The light might be the way. Diet, right? Or something like that. Zero calories. Pure soda cola. It's just. It's basically the sugar water. Tasty though. <laughs> Thanks for being interested in what I drink. This is not. If I had beer, I'd definitely be drinking that crap. And every time one of my Pokemon would die, I would take a shot. Or something like that, I don't know. You look like a beer can. How much of that you don't give me an experience I didn't see? Aha! Level 3, faster. That looks like a... I should just slide instead of a beer. No, I wish I had bottles of beer with me. Because I'm not really going to go now. Stay inside. You know what? I should, I'm going to do that next time I stream. I'm gonna do drunk Nuzlocke, so I make the <laughs> drunk Nuzlocke challenge. I make like the, the worst mistakes possible. Catch it, name it Pinhead. Don't you know what a Nuzlocke challenge is? I can't catch anymore in this area. I caught a Kakuna already. 